I basically remember everything that happened. Every time I look at it, it the whole thing just rehearses in my head. Sunrise on June 25th, a nightmare of a morning for Chad Jones. The car wrapped around the pole and the pole didn't move and it just smashed down on my leg. And eventually the, the axle or the car snapped and it shot straight up my leg and that's what really messed me up. His SUV total with him in the driver's seat, conscious yet badly injured. The axle snapped in half, ran straight through my heel, then it shot up and broke my tib and my fib bones, and it shot out on both sides. His injuries so severe that for the next 10 hours, Jones was on an operating table, fighting for his life. It's a fight he would eventually win. It wasn't my turn to leave yet, you know. God put me on this earth for a reason, and it wasn't time to leave, so I just got to figure out what that is. No. And now he knows, two-year-old Chad Jones Jr., destined to follow in his dad's footsteps. He certainly got his dad's moves down. Touchdown, Chad Jones. Do you touchdown dance? Do you touch? <laughs> hey, I gotta help me with this. You stand tall. You got gotcha. you. But before Jones can do his own touchdown dance again, he on? must first learn how to walk again. Twice a week, he undergoes therapy. The scars from his accident clearly visible serve as a reminder of what he's trying to overcome with every movement. His swelling has dropped about 75 percent. Uh, we've seen his swelling drop from that point. Um, so he's come a long way in a matter of, he's been with us. He started about really a month, probably a month. Yeah, about August 4th he started with us. He's come a long way to step through. His steps, albeit small, are in the right direction. The goal is for Jones to be jogging by mid-December and sprinting into August. There you go. Good, Chad. Try to step through which is amazing when you consider his injuries almost cost him his left leg. Me not being able to walk again, me not being able to run again, but with nine things, the tables have turned. So much so that Jones believes his once promising NFL career has promised once again. I have no doubt in my mind that I will play football again. You know, I'm, I surround myself with positive people, my girlfriend, even my son, you know, he believes I'm going to play football again, my parents. Family, friends, you know, I just surround myself with positive people because I'm a positive person, and that's how I think. And his biggest fan, game face and all, couldn't agree more. Again? I'm Juan Kincaid, fourth down on four.